Good morning. Boy, I'd really like that one. <laughs> yes, yeah, so here we are. It's another morning, another move. Loading up. I'm loading underneath a power line here, so got the boom stretched out so I got clearance lawns watching for early morning traffic on the head sticking out there now these tires are an incredible pain in the neck it's hard work laying them out and then you got to clean up after them but uh, they do work amazingly you can load without them you know hundred thousand pounds on on these soft asphalt roads you know what it would be happening one of the things i really appreciate about the tiger cat the thing is just so smooth it was the first thing i noticed and it pretty much sold me that first second i got in the cab and hit the controls it's just so smooth it's there's it's like nothing else and it really is a pleasure to load with it because you know i load i'll throttle it all the way down and i'm in slow mode or turtle mode and you've got full power well you know you don't really have full power but you've you've certainly got adequate power and you've got full response so you know i'm i can creep on and turn travel and you can do it really slowly and really smoothly and that's important you know loading equipment is dangerous you're climbing around on wet stuff you know and, and uh, you know like Juan's helping me he's right there um, there's always the possibility you could slide off the low boy and head could you know slide over so having that smoothness in the machine is just such a it's a beautiful thing I, I just I love this tiger cat buncher and as some of you guys have pointed out it's a it's a tremendous trailer it uh, it's in good shape and you know Juan keeps it that way so I don't mind making the extra effort and digging my tracks out so we keep it clean you know when I'm loading I just watch his hands you know and, and uh, where he wants me that's where I'm gonna put it and, uh, it's a pleasure working with him it always is Yeah, so right here, you know, I've got full power. I can climb up over the approach, just barely settle down when I hit the top of that, flatten out, away I go. Full power to both tracks, slow and smooth. Juan's got the single axle booster on. Generally for me, that's what he likes, but it depends a lot on what he's doing after, if it's an early morning move. So this configuration of stretching out with the head vertical um, is what we generally move it at. 
We have tipped the head sideways, which I think looks kind of cool, but it's actually kind of a pain in the neck, so we don't do that very often. Yeah, so here's the fun part. <laughs> so it's wet, but at least the tires weren't full of water. Generally they are if it's pouring down rain. But even after digging the tracks out, you can see I tread a little bit of mud up on there. <clears throat> yeah, I pack a, a flat shovel and a broom, it's a heavy broom. I cut it down so it fits in my side box with the other long handle tools. And those are pretty critical tools for moving. I also want to put another plug in for these blue gorilla gloves. I get them at Home Depot and for moving, yeah. they're perfect. Do we, to, do we get to go home now? Yeah, we Let me get that as shit on the side. Yeah, so uh, like I said, Lon takes really good care of the trailer and he, he's well equipped. It's good hardware. He takes good care of it, so it's in good shape and ready to roll. Don't have to worry about anything falling off when we're rolling down the highway. Actually, I think it's going in the shop this coming week. It's, uh, he's got some cracks um, on the uh, approach ramps at the front of the trailer. They're uh, just given the design, they're kind of unsupported, and given the tough you know, conditions we load in regularly, it puts a lot of pressure on them. So he came up with a design to kind of beef them up and it's going in the shop and Nate's going to fab that up and put it right for him. So. Yeah, so there you go. We're moving again. Another morning, another move. We all do it, but just wanted to kind of make a make a few points about some of the things that we do. Damn, that's a nice looking load.